Good afternoon, good morning, good evening, good whatever time of day it may be for you, ladies and gentlemen. I, the Layback Gamer, and we are packed with some more Dragon Age Origins. Now, it may look a little different on screen for you. I know it looks very different on screen for me, and that's because uh, I got a new monitor. So, yeah. Uh, wow, this is massive. Wow, this is, uh, this is a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. Uh, let me know if you guys are okay with seeing it at this. I believe the current resolution is... Well, it might come out a little bit different in uh, in post, since I have OBS designed to shrink the... Vo there, not shrink, but uh, reduce... I get reduce the resolution down a little bit. But still, this is... Jesus is massive. Uh, over the holidays, I got a new monitor, and it was honestly wasn't really expected to get one. And anyways, it's a it's a it's pretty big, thirty two inch, and it can go up to four K if I have the computer processors for it. So yeah, uh, I'm looking at a massive screen. I just hope I don't get a headache from playing this, since I'm trying still trying to get used to it. Gonna take me a little while, but anyways, uh, we're back with some more Dragon Age, and in today's episode, uh, well, we have a few side quests to do. We have a couple places we got uh, Orzammar to visit first, but let's see. I also got a new keyboard, so if I don't, but I'm playing around with the keys and it seems a little funny. Uh, that's just because I'm trying to find it. Find the proper keys, you know, use this with. Let's get started. Jeez, I almost have to pull the pull the seat backwards. And I gotta try something here. I'm gonna move my microphone back. My apologies if you can hear the sounds of it. Okay, hold on. Uh, still trying to find the most optimum setup for my micro oh, now I just hit it with my keyboard. We're trying to find the more most optimum position and I think this might be it. I could I'm okay with sacrificing a little bit of a let's see you know just a little bit. There we go. I'd have to uh get a, another or do play around with the settings in OBS so I don't hear myself on accident. But, you know, I, I, yeah, this is much better. I'm a little bit, a little further back from the, from the screen. I got my keyboard up close to me. I could get used to this. I could get used to it indeed. All right, let's see. And I'm okay with not seeing a, a tiny portion of my screen because of the mop, because my microphone's blocking it. So we're going into the deep roads. Yes. So, Shale? Yes. Yes. I'm the rogue, so Ogryn. Indeed. I guess we could bring Liliana down there. It's been a while. Now let's pop back into Orzammar. I was already at the tower finishing up a few things. Now I just have to go into Orzammar. And I think we're running across that mage I had a quest for. I unlocked a quest for. Who the heck are you? Ah, a fellow traveler of the Fair Lands. Are you a seeker, perchance? My packs are light, but I have a tome of strange origin. The Deus V. Eternus, rumored to be the last message to a sinful world from the Maker himself. Didn't you just sell a few of these copies to the Circle Tower? I have uh, no idea what you're talking about, and uh, neither do these large men carrying swords. Get them! Warden senses. Yes, indeed, my warden senses are tingling. Use an acid flask and, uh... Tingling. Do that. Okay, thank you to whoever cast a big fireball. How do I get up here? Oh, I think I have found the longest route up here. Back here. Oh my, everybody's dead. Let's get started. 
Alright, let's see. We have a uh, cameo hood. I think it's called cameo hood. A little bit of gold and a rune. Oh, I could get used to this. I could get used to this very easy. This my, uh. As you might tell, this is the first. Might be able to tell this is the first time I'm actually playing this should be easy enough. Uh, or using monitor. To, my new mo my new monitor to play a game for well for the channel. So I'm still trying to work out all the little uh, little things. I actually want to. I think I should probably turn up the audio a little bit. Just a pinch. I'll do that off of uh, off of OBS. So one second. Stay with that setting. There we go. It's a little bit better. We just need to pop into the deep roads. Now we still do have a little bit in the Iduken Taig to explore around, so we'll start there. Then afterwards I have to go to uh, Ortag Taig. Uh, let's see here, Liliana, what do you got? Coughing blood. No. Oh well. Let's see here, you need a... Uh, or be a little more dexterous. I guess we can put all that into strength too. How nice. Uh, let's go tactic. Don't really have a need for anything else. And I guess... Finish up your archery tree. Don't need you to do lock picking. Or actually put there. And then I guess assassin. We go. Alrighty. Let us move out to the AI Duke and Tig. One of the one down things about turning up the gain a little bit on my microphone is now you might be able to hear a little bit in the background. I know I heard that one. I get used to it a little bit better. I do know that at the start of the Dwarf Noble campaign, you do get to come down here. There are some other passageways opened up that you can't normally get access to. I think most of the creatures down here, at least until we get to the, uh, the Taig itself, should be relatively cleared. Also means that up until that point, it's looted, too. There's a pick. Except for that. Oh, bloody set. This might actually be the last of the Topsiders. Bag of limb. Another... Ah, okay, so it's another quest that we missed down here. I mean, is it some kind of fade beast one? Carving was done in deep roads near Keridan's Crossing, so we gotta go back to Keridan's Crossing then. Ow! Wayne, do a cleansing aura. That didn't really work. I am still trapped. On the cold web. Just do. I thought that would fix me. Oh, well, I guess I'm now fixed. So, let's see. Let's pop a mass rejuvenation. As you say. Alright, that, this, nine, zero, sweep, da da da, 
I got a curse of mortality on. Yep. Did you take off? Oh, you didn't take off. Leanna's got a song on, I believe. Yep. Shale, I need you to get this. I need fighter. And let's see on here. It. So loop gen lock up. Where are we in terms of? Uh, let's see here. So to lead probably not sure with it. Lead. That's another passageway that we haven't explored yet, unless it's a blocked off, in which case we can't go down there. Oh yay, deep spiders. Wait here. Back in. Nope. Okay. Alright, now it seems to be overpowering. Or overpowering. Kind of why I don't. See, when it's outside of combat, the thing's way too quiet. And then when we go inside combat, it suddenly gets very loud. This should be easy enough. I, I don't win. I can't win by this scenario. I do can. Yeah, this is the other back half of the I do can tag. No, we've already we know we've already been here. Wait, I really didn't loot this. I thought I would have looted this place up. Yeah, I thought I would have looted this place up. You. Chests. Nice. Yeah, I don't, I'm not sure if when it, this is currently processes it, I think at double. But I, I'm seeing here or on my screen is double on what I had set up or originally had set up. So it might be that when this goes up, uh, the res I guess the resolution is going to be a lot better. I'm not a hundred percent sure. There's going to be nobody in these, uh, in these tunnels. Good thing we came back here for that. Uh, get that quest objective or the hidden quest, I guess, because you would never have gotten it without. Finding all the parts. So yeah. Back into here. Passageway. If we go straight ahead, that passageway has also not been explored. Unless it's a dead end. I don't know if we've gone over there. Probably have. This might lead back out to the main road. Deep stalkers, yep, stalkers. So this is actually right on the edge of the deep road. This will lead back, but I think that'll become a dead. That's a dead end. I'm gonna come up on this. So try here. If anything here? Yeah, this looks like to be a dead end. We can't keep going that way. I'm pretty sure. In uh. 
the when you're playing as the dwarf noble, you can be able to go that way. I don't remember. That a little uh, as you wish. little treasure. I figured this would happen. That was the leader. Go ahead and set down. Nice swing of the swords. I actually should turn off momentum. Right now I have Spider Duelist on. I don't quite have the ability to. Oh, yeah, I also forget. You're forgetting I got this. Need to be. Needed blades. Rain's blood. Uh, or Rain's life. It increases damage. Alright, I imagine the last little portion is just going to be... Well... It, it could possibly be the last bit of what we're missing. Or, let's see. Uh, we already got that. Let's, uh, no. This I still think we're going to access that in Dinarim. Deep Roads, Place of Power. I don't believe we found... We, I'm 99% sure. Wait, maybe we did find it. That alt, hmm, we may have found this, not the one in Denerim, though. I'll look it up later. But I'm sure we may have found the place of power down here. Which would mean that we still have to find the one in Denerim. And there's only one place I could think in Denerim where it is, and... Well, it's the same place that everything seems to be that I can't access. In the alienage. Well, oh jeez, I didn't mean. Actually, did want to. Gaining from a song of valor to the curiosity, magica or stamina region. Character. All right, fair enough. Pretty nice. Already explored on the other side of there. Dark spawn. There's a dark spawn there. Last place we have yet to go down is... Oh, I guess we can't go down that way. I think you go down that way... Uh, during the no Dwarf Noble quest. So, yeah. Uh, should be... Go there. Yeah, I think that's everything in this place. So, off to, uh, the crossroads. Yes, that's, uh, we're looking for a Sunder, I believe. Near Keridan's Crossing, so... Oh, yeah, that would, that is... Next stage? It's a shame we didn't find, we didn't, uh, grab that while we were down here the first time. May have been a may have been able to save my trip myself a trip to Keridan's Crossing. A ton of exploring. Alright, let's get out of here. Back to the deep roads. near here it's going to be in. possible that it could be in the ortog tag 
I don't think we have to go all the way back down to uh, the Anvil of the Void or uh, back to the the, the uh, Dark Spawn trenches. Gonna keep our eyes peeled. I'm just gonna be down here somewhere. Be the fan. I think this would be the fastest way to get down. Again, I don't, I don't remember what I'm looking for. I know I've beaten this quest before, which is why I did have some memory of it. I don't remember where I had to go to complete it. He's uh, he's been a hot moment. Not even sure if I beat this on my test run. Now that I think about it. If I gotta look it up, I'll quickly look it up. Probably cut it out of the video too. Uh, let's see. Uh, that appears right there. Don't want to quite be there. Road marker. Possible that no, I think that's a completely side area. Uh, good marker. Good marker. Wouldn't be up there, I don't think. Where would you? I was a quest. No one. Has the Elder Mage ever encountered another golem? I suppose there used to be one deactivated one stored in the tower's vault. I wonder what became of it. After all that's happened to the circle, I'd be surprised if it isn't completely destroyed. Why was it deactivated? Did it crush some arrogant mage's head after one too many commands? I do not know, Shale. Perhaps it is just irreparably broken. I think it stayed in the tower because no one could move it. It is very, very old. I believe it came from Devinter a long time ago. Perhaps someone bought it so it would guard the tower. Its people do enjoy their slaves, don't they? It... it was not a slave. It was... it is a... A tool. As I thought. No, don't deny it. No. <laughs> oh, shell. I do love the party banter and that just randomly happens in the background. Alright, well, it's clearly not down the rest of this. I don't think, could it be in Keridin's crap? Could it actually be in the Ortsat tag? I don't know. This is the place where I think this is the area where we can't find all the top cider parts. That inside Keridin or the Ortag tag. Ugh, I don't remember. Oh, I do not remember, ladies and gentlemen. Remember it all. Yes. I could remember where this was. 
I seem to be uh, occasionally cutting off. Gotta make sure not to mumble myself. Or I gotta turn up the gain just a, a tiny bit. There. A bit better? I think that should be it. Yeah, it should be a little bit better. There is another part up here. Excuse me. Realize that that microphone can pick up that. They can't pick up me just mumbling. I don't like that. Hershey microphone. That was where uh, that that was where another quest ended. Maybe it was a bit in the Ortog tag. Near Keridan's Crossing, but I would think it'd be here. If it mentions a location, it tends to be in that location. I can run this way. Yeah. Cool. Sounds like somebody's having fun upstairs. I do apologize if you can hear that, uh, the sounds of tapping through my microphone. Their the family's upstairs, and I think they're playing with the dog. Or they're playing crib. Where, where is this quest? Quest location, reveal thyself to me. Although I am starting to think that it might actually be in the Ortag Tag. There was... I do remember... There was an altar that we touched while we were there. I don't remember if it was part of the Place of Power quest. There's a... It's gotta be in here. Maybe, well, maybe it might not be in here. That was... Uh, that was either a Bag of Limbs or top side. No, that was for the Topsider quest. Which was finished up in here. Yeah, this is it's gotta be in the Ortog Tag then. I guess does that technically count as near? We just went through the enough. We just went through the entire place and I did not see anything. Unfortunate. All right, but there was an there was an altar that we had touched here. I don't remember if that is associated with places of power, or if it's associated with a uh, wit with a sunder. When is this yours? Oh, my bag of components. Thank you, dear. I was wondering where it got to. You left it by the fire at camp. Oh. Yes, I remember now. How age creeps up on you and brings with it forgetfulness. You're a great mage, Wen, and you're sharper and wiser than many people I know. Some young ones, too. Oh, but you should have seen me 15, 20 years ago. The fires have dimmed somewhat since then. But thank you, Liliana, for picking up after this old lady. You know, now I kind of wish that I brought... Uh, companions that we don't often see, or I don't often bring, like Sten, after we have obviously give him some armor, maybe, uh, maybe, uh, who else would I want to bring? Oh yeah, actually Armabari instead of Shale. Oh, I'd still want a mage. So I guess maybe, uh, Little Puppy, and... Wasn't down here. Little area. On it. Ah. 
I found another quest. Topstar's story has been revealed to location. A Topsider's story has revealed location of his final battle with the Darkspawn. Okay. Oh, then that other quest wasn't Topsider. Uh, let's see. Codex. Builders have been able to pull off spell combinations. I'm likely not going to try and figure out any, any more of these, but there is one where if you're able to freeze an opponent and then land a critical strike on an attack that does, I guess, smashing, that would smash something, like, uh, for instance, uh, say, you, as a mage, you use, a fr you freeze your target, and then you use Rock Fist to, against it, if a critical hits it, then it will actually shatter the target and instantly, uh, instantly kill it. Here, so owning signs, the dead cast, it's top cider, top cider's honor. A stone, take this top. Welcome, serve the deep roads, many will. Family laid. Thanks. Hey, uh. Ah, great. I got a feeling we got to go back to the dead trenches to finish the top cider. If you really want to fit it, like complete the this game, or at least do every quest that you can, I'd high like while you're down here, I would highly, highly, Highly recommend that you look through every nook and cranny, otherwise you don't have to come back down here for a second go. I mean, granted, we're down here. Provided we go passageways that we have already been through. I'm not going back down there. Uh, you should be altar... Okay, so altar sundering. That's where we put together a sunder. So then I have not found the place of power down here with the deep roads. Which then leaves the question, where is it? I already looted that. Be careful not to hit the spider webs. I know I did activate a few, but there were some I didn't, and I'd prefer to keep it that way. Altar of Thundering. Take it here, and now we can fight the demon. Connect. Place the body parts you in You have restored that which was cut asunder and revealed my hiding place. Speak your intention. Seek you vengeance or reward. Now, I don't remember what exactly this creature gives you, but while I quickly look it up, uh, this is not a dark spawn, believe it or not, and I think, well, this is the second time we've seen it, but this is a pride demon. And it's a demon that if you play Inquisitions, hold on. Uh, if you play Inquisition, you'll be very familiar with these, with these, uh, with these demons. Uh, we, de we we will eventually be playing it, but uh, for the time being, this is, I think this is maybe one of two, possibly more, a couple more instances where... All right, so we can either kill it Or we are uh, can allow it to set free. Uh, if we if we allow it to leave, it'll give us twenty five gold and fifty silver. Quest log will mention that others are possibly hurt from our greed. 
And if we kill it, it gives a little bit of experience, drops a uh, generic chest plate, and nothing more. Now, if I was you know, the real entrepreneur, I would say I would free him. However, in terms of what our character would say, uh, unfortunately for our pockets, we're going to have to kill you. Not cowardice. A fight you want. A fight you shall have. All right, so here we go. Activate that. That. Do that. Oh, oh dear. Ah, great. I'm frozen again. A hey, shale. Do the punch. Liliana, a nice scatter shot. Wayne, enter everybody's weapons once more. Now give it a frost. And you quickly follow that with a stone fist. Ow. Alright, let's reapply those debuffs. Oh, chill. Don't do it. Alright, Fade Beast. Good night. I know it says Fade Beast here, but it's a Pride Demon. In game. It, it does get later renamed to Pride Demon. Unfortunately, this one did not want to drop it, so... How unfortunate. <coughs> Excuse me. And I believe that's another completed quest for down here. Orzammar... Uh, asunder. Let's see here. So, now that that's done with, I gotta find this place of power. I guess, uh, hold on. While, uh, while we're here, let's quickly. Ah, uh, I forgot. Uh, on my on the new key on the new keyboard I got I actually have a uh, six G or six keys uh, n different key new keys so G1 G2 G3 four five six I think though all those are programmable keys so uh I do get the chance to I might want to consider pro I'm gonna try to program them to OBS so I can hit say G6 to uh, stop and end recording G5 to pause maybe G4 will start the stream. And yeah, it's a, I like it. It's a pretty cool feature. Anyways, can you hear this? And here, if I, I'm just gonna be quiet for a second, but can you, can I, can we pick up the keys? No, that fortunately, uh, our, I wanna know where it is in the deep roots. So I definitely got it in here. West Brazilian Forest. We probably did that. Ortog Taig. Ah, okay. Alright, yeah. That's exactly what I thought. <coughs> that's what I thought. Uh, so the altar doubles up as... The place of power, so we're done here. Which means we still need to go into the date into the dead trenches to to finish up the topsiders quest. Which is good. We don't have anything else to do after that down here. And then once we finish, we're gonna go right back to Orzammar and turn in the quest. I think that's it. Now, if what I see here is true. We have a couple, we have three blank spaces for undiscovered quests. I guess they're, uh, I suppose, quote unquote, hidden quests in the game that you get after you, well, you get, you unlock them after uh, collecting all the codex for them. So, you're a codex hunter, you're 
almost certain to get the like we are doing right now. But I believe they get uh, they'll be unlocked within the lands meet. So no need to worry about accidentally missing out on them. Okay, over into the dead trench. We'll finish up this quest, and then I believe that'll be... Well, then we'll return to Orzammar, finish up there, and we're good to go. Yeah, my uh, initial gut feeling was correct in that you do activate the quest. Uh... That that altar was also a place was a place of power. And I just didn't remember that it was also the place that you had to go for Sunder. I guess the Legion of the Dead isn't going to be around here. Uh, Baltimore. I think I pronounced that correct. I gotta search everywhere around here. It's Topsider. It the journal only ever mentions the. Uh, let's just take a quick look. Long say and seek your death in the trenches. I believe in this regard, it is talking about a, uh, I believe the journal is referencing a Grey Warden. Probably the first, one of the first ones to start tra the tradition of, uh, we go to the deep, we go, we'll go to the, the deep roads and spend the rest of our days killing Darkspawn when we can feel the taint about to call, or the taint's call. Locks. Okay, I missed some bodies over here. Flask. <coughs> and so that leads here. One of the one of these places has to contain. Something related to the top side. If I can't find it after going to the trench, throughout here, we'll go take a quick look. It's po it could be possible that it then is not located in here. Map. Yeah, again, I can't quite remember where the ending of these quests are since I don't I haven't done them enough to memor to kind of commit to memory. Wait, uh, is that? I haven't done these enough to commit to memory where each are lo where you know each of uh, each objective point is just enough that I know. Hey. There's this quest. This this is associated with a quest, and this is associated with a quest. That if you collect enough pieces for it, you get the quest. I'm gonna assume that you are who we're looking for. That. That. To the blades, trigger momentum. It's either you or me. Gonna be me. Ourselves go very quick. That prepare all the the fancy sweep. On it. Hot forum. Heavy chainmail. Upsiders blade. This has been updated. We found all the pieces. Turning it to his corpse may bring him some peace. The top's final resting place is the cave's east. Oh, I have to go back to the old tag.
Okay. That part I didn't remember. Well, I guess maybe I didn't actually finish this this quest. I was able to find all the pieces for it, but I don't remember ever encountering the darks that dark spawn. Oh, and did I never have I never completed this quest? Have, have I? I don't remember. I do not remember at all, ladies and gentlemen. Getting another encoding overload. I've been noticing that's been popping up quite a bit. Yeah, okay, hold on one second. This, and hopefully it should be a little bit better. I turned down the frame rate a little bit, as well as the, well, what it's outputting, just by a bit. Doesn't do a 1080p anymore, but I think it does, I, I turned it down to 960, so hopefully it shouldn't be too much of a difference. But, hope, well, Hopefully it doesn't look too much different while still giving, well, while improving the amount of lag. Because I noticed throughout uh, that last little segment there, it was just going off the off the charts. I think it was just like, yep, every couple seconds it's doing this. I mean, I wish you guys could see it from my perspective. I, I truly wish you guys could see it. My on my end it looks absolutely it looks really really nice. Oh nope, and there's the encoder acting up again. Uh, the thing. I gotta go back here. It's the caves east of the area, so probably the tomb that we found. We'll, we'll we'll see how it looks in the end. Hopefully, you remind me of Lady Cecily. Who? She was an Orlesian lady. My mother served her until she died, and Lady Cecily let me stay instead of turning me out on the street. You are like her in some ways. You have the same poise, the same air of nobility. Oh, child, <laughs> I am hardly noble. I learned that nobility isn't just something you are born with. I have met nobles who are very petty and mean, complete degenerates. Then, they are people with a certain dignity and grace. It draws you to them, no matter who you are or who they are. I think the lowest peasant can have the most noble spirit, and it will always shine through. It is this nobility of spirit that you share with Sicily. Why, thank you, Liliana. It is very kind of you to say that. Read. Go ahead and open up this tomb. Quest has been completed. Here we got. So, look down here. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's acting up again. So, hope it stays like that. Uh, it's definitely not these. Not that. Probably that. Okay. Perhaps we should do a quick search up of this quest. Well, Topsider's Honor. Oh, there we go. I didn't scroll up. <laughs> My bad. Alright, Topsider's Armor. Good against, uh... I guess... Eat, or, it's good against the undead. Unfortunately, we're not really going up against a whole lot of those. So, it's just going to end up uh, in the Warden's Keep. But, that's another quest done. 
And we'll have just enough time in this episode to get the last bit. So, yeah, it looks like it's a performance. Oh, I also did turn down the uh, FPS to 48. I didn't want to go too, too low, because I, I originally had it at six smooth 60. So, hopefully it's okay. Let's get started. If I do got to turn it down, I'll probably end up turning the resolution down uh, one more step if it becomes a consistent problem. Probably is gonna what's probably gonna help if I want to stream again. In my opinion, nowadays you want to do minimum 480. If you could do 720, then you do 720. If you go push beyond that, heck. That's even better. But it looks like, uh... Looks like my laptop probably can't handle it. Not without, uh... Not without an upgrade to my CPU. If I do get a job, I would like to actually build a... Build a brand new computer. The ground up. Let's see. Hello. Hello. How can I... Oh, it's you! And it's been... Well, quite a while. Enough time to get to the circle and back, I hope. Oh, please tell me what they said. Any time's over. He's accepted you for your study. Ancestors, bless you. I can't believe it. There hasn't even been a dwarven observer in the circle since your Relvin in the 13th century. Uh, I, I, I need to pack. No, my parents would get suspicious. I need to go. Is there anything I should bring? Books? Tuition? They just need every ally they can get. Then I should go before my parents come looking for me. If you ever go to the circle again, maybe I'll see you there. Considering that it's been a long time since a dwarf has been to the circle tower, at least I would think that'd be a pretty prestigious honor to be invited by them. I'm not sure why the, their, their parents would be so upset. Oh yeah, this is the place. Hey, uh, how you doing? You again. Here to buy something, or were you just thinking of wrecking another part of my shop? Anything of what's been happening with the new king? I stay out of politics. It's not good for a smith to get the attention of those who grant vendors licenses. May the ancestors bless King Balin's reign, and that's the end of it. Things have calmed down with a firm hand on the throne again. Have a daughter, or well, hold on. Let me. uh... Of course. Uh, keep in mind, we also take items on trade. Yes, that's nice. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna buy all your metal shards. Let's see if there's anything else that I'd like here. Ah, uh, the encoder. All right. I guess I gotta go down to uh, seven twenty, or maybe uh, eight forty. Go, go to 840 first. Yeah, if I have the option to, I'll try 840 out, see if it uh, fixes it up a little bit. Let's see. Sell you everything I don't want. This stuff is going... I'm going to go ahead and... Sorry, I want that for shale. Yeah, we're keeping that for shale. That's garbage. That's this one sticking with us. That back. Go, Smith Start. And let's see. So, Shale. Large Flawless. I have Brilliant. The difference between Flawless and Brilliant, as you can see here, is a little extra spirit resistance. Plus some spell resistance and a little bit of mental resistance. Difference in the crystals. Eight of them, I guess. And this one, whereas the flawless is going to give us two attributes, I imagine it would still say, and it would uh, increase our spirit damage as well as armor penetration a little bit. We're getting more constitution, more regen in battle, and a lot of extra nature damage. And I think the regen is going to be very valuable. You 
you again? Yes, me Here again. to buy something, or were you just thinking of wrecking another part of my shop? You know, you really ought to have a better attitude. I did save you from the Carta. They could have been stealing everything from your shop. You gotta show a little... You know what? Are you... You have a daughter named, uh... Named Dagna. I... Has she been bothering you? It's a whiff of surface stink, and she's like a cave tick. Won't let go. Guess what? Should we tell her? She wants to become a ma- Wants to become- Why would I- s I know that- I, I, Okay, I- I know I wouldn't say it, because in-game, I- My character would know that- No, she can't. She's a dwarf. She can't. I'm curious as to what would happen- she wants to become a mage! Ho <laughs> ho! Ah, oh, that girl. I've been telling her for years to give up those foolish notions. Magic's a human trick. If Dagna wants enchantment, I can apprentice her to a lyrium crafter. This is Dagna's dream, if it makes her happy. Do you even know what that means? If Dagna goes to the surface, she forfeits her caste. She'll never be able to marry or, or work in Orzammar again. Dwarves don't do magic. Dagna knows that. It's just the childhood fantasy that dies hard. Please, if you see her, send her back and let me talk some sense into her. You again. Yes, me again. Here to buy something, or were you just thinking of wrecking another part of my shop? Oh, okay. Never mind then. I guess I can't do anything. I, for a hundred generations. My father made his name by inventing a fall and tacit, which were integrated into the cuirass. But, uh, I'm guessing by your face, you're not a smith yourself. Wasn't she? Wasn't Peregrine? Yeah, of course she was. That she was. The best to walk these tunnels since Carradine himself. Threw it away, chasing old dreams, though. I should go. You're welcome back if you change your mind. Wow. You needn't bring a lot of coin. We also accept items in trade. Ow. I actually probably would have said the third op the third option. She's gone off to to the tower. Anyways, that I believe completes all the quests. Available to us in Orzammar. At least for the time being. Uh, we may have to come back down here again in a little bit. Or, hey, Liliana. I see you're still with Morrigan. I thought you said she didn't mean anything to you. What are you playing at? You tell me you like me, that I mean something to you, and you have her on the side? It's not fair to either Morrigan or me. Do you say the same things to her that you say to me? I have not- I haven't even talked with her since the beginning of the game! <laughs> All I'm doing is just helping. That's what I- Why is everybody so jealous? Of course not! I haven't spoken to her since the beginning of the game! My goodness, some people are very jealous. Just show me some respect. Show us some respect, please. you want from me stop playing with my feelings if you want her tell me so i care for you more deeply than i can say but i i can't watch you going to her all the time i haven't done this since the beginning of the game liliana what are you what just because i have a high disposition i'm trying to be friends with everybody here this it, this is who i am as a great warden Uh, I don't even remember the last time I even had her as a party member. Look, I haven't done anything wrong. All I've done was just help people. That's it. It's all I've done. I've done nothing to anybody else. Nothing. Just help. Because I saw everyone's pro- uh. 
And this is probably going to affect when I go to kill the drat, when I go to kill her mother. Over with me and Morgan. I, I am sorry I had to force this on you. I couldn't stand by any longer wondering if I meant anything to you. Uh, it actually hurts because theoretically this should never have happened. In a real life circumstance, this doesn't happen. Besides, we're not even a thing. Calm down, just calm down, calm down. Oh, hold on. I, re I just remembered. I Oh, gee. It just remember who I am. This is going to might play a factor a little bit later. But you mean everything to me. And I believe you when you say that. We should talk later. Oh, that hurt. I have heard much about the halls of the Dwarven Kings, but the stories do it no justice. It is so strange, harsh, yet beautiful. Very grand. And have you seen those tiny pig-like burrowing animals? They are adorable. I wish I could have one as a pet. But they must be hard to catch and... Oh, just ignore me. I'm so silly sometimes. Let's just go. I think that was the quest. I did want to quickly finish that quest up while we're here because there is technically one other hidden quest that you could do here, but why are you jealous? I oh, have. Yeah. When was the last time I talked to you? Like, ladies and gentlemen, if you're watching this, you could answer. You could tell old me in the comments section. When was the last time I talked to Morgan? Hmm? When was. And welcome back. You have made it to the end of the video. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed, hit that subscribe button if you really enjoyed, maybe share this video to anybody who you think will enjoy my content, and also don't forget to check out some of my other stuff. I don't only, I'm not only doing this game, but I also have done a ton of other games. Well, a ton, I think, in cap, well, I'm not sure how many games I've done at this point, but anyways, here's a little, small little bit of collection of games that I've done. If you look on screen, it should take you to either another video or a playlist. Maybe you'll enjoy that. Perhaps you might not. I don't know. We will find out. Hope you all enjoyed, and until next one, take it easy.